What's happening, man? The size, the Black Viking is back and ready to react. Now, this one um, is a reaction to the mean tweets that I guess celebrities are reacting to. Uh, let's see how they react to mean tweets about them. Come on, play it, motherfuckers. Come on, now. There are people who think Julia Roberts is hot. Her gigantic mouth looks <laughs> like it will devour an elephant in one bite. Thank you, Chemotherapy 7, and good luck. Don Cheadle seems like the kind of guy who I wouldn't want to hang around with under any circumstances ever. He's so f***ing whack. Honestly. Ashley Kutcher needs to get hit by a bus ASAP. I hate Courtney Cox. I f***ing hate her. Oh, That's sweet. If I said it once, I've said it a hundred times. Andy Garcia. <laughs> funny or attractive she has an annoying voice and just plainly sucks why does she have her own show i feel like this is more than 140 characters david blaine looks like his voice is putting his face to sleep <laughs> don rickles looks like yoda Ethan <laughs> hawk seems like a guy who wasn't supposed to be a movie star but he slipped through the cracks and everyone was just like Okay. Matthew McConaughey is a dick turd. A dick turd. What the f is a dick turd? Exactly. What the fuck is a dick turd? Oh, f off, June Squib. And one, two, eight, three. You f off. I hope Jeremy Pippen falls off in public. Kit Harrington is a pretty terrible Jon Snow. In the show, he seems like a big bitch with a stupid look on his face. <laughs> Hashtag bad casting. Emma Stone looks like she smells like cat piss. <laughs> okay. Gary Oldman sucks, and his accents are annoying. <laughs> <laughs> so he took it the best. <laughs> he just crack it up. <laughs> said, yep. She got her sounds like she has a in her mouth. Ah! Hearing her talk. What's wrong with having a d in my mouth? <laughs> Especially if it's her. <laughs> yeah, you see that? Look, let me explain something, Magnus Sites. And this is how you have to take all ridicule. So you have to realize that, see, all these celebrities here, they're at the top of their game, okay? And just like the ridicule that I get, on my channel from the racists from the naysayers from the people who believe that i'll never make one million subscribers i'll never be a success the people that call me ugly they call sarah ugly they you know all these things that they say i don't give a damn and it's funny because i used to reply in the beginning but i don't need more i can't it's you know I, I told you i got this suit of armor this positive armor on and every time they shoot at me bing bing you know what I mean? That's how it's gotta be. You have to believe in yourself, especially when no one else will. You see, they're stars also because more people believed in them than not. That's the reason why they're all at the top of their game right now, okay? Now, and, and that's how I need y'all to look at ridicule that you get from bullies, and stuff you get online, on my channel. Sometimes some of you will comment and then someone starts attacking you right away. Just block them, ban them, fuck them. Forget all about them. You know what I mean? I've been called everything. It does not matter at all. And I'm sure that when I make it, I'll be eventually reading you some mean tweets or mean YouTube comments, you know, and laughing at them. And what you gotta realize is a lot of times, 
A lot of times, people that are like this are hurting anyway. The people that are commenting, they're hurting and they're hating at the fact that they're not successful in their lives. So their only way to make themselves feel better is to bring someone else down. Or they will try to point out your flaws because they have too many, you know? It, it just makes them feel better. Some of them are psychopaths, although, although not all psychopaths are like that, but a lot of times when you try to respond to someone that's trying to hurt you, you gotta realize that psychopaths don't have a conscience. They, they really can't hurt their feelings anyway. So you get into this endless battle with someone that can't be hurt, and you're trying to match wits with someone that just can't be hurt, at least mentally. So. I hope this has been a lesson, and I love these. I absolutely love these videos, you know? I, I, I look at this with inspiration. Don't even, it don't fucking matter, man. Like, and, and I've got my own opinion about some of them celebrities on there, but you know what I mean? They don't give a fuck about what I think, and I like the majority of them that I just saw, especially the last one. <laughs> so anyway, um, yeah. One million subscribers.